Hi, I'm Ema. I'm a grandma and a mom. And welcome back for chapter nine of The Adventures of Sophie Mouse, A New Friend by Poppy Green, illustrated by Jennifer A. Bell. Chapter nine. This is the second to the last chapter of the book. See, we're almost done. Old Friends and New Friends. Excuse me, Olivia. I mean, Mrs. Snake, said Sophie. Did you grow up around here? Olivia's eyes went wide in surprise. How did you guess? She said with a laugh. I used to play all the time in this very buttercup patch. With George and Lily Mouse, Sophie asked excitedly. A speechless Olivia Snake nodded. So Sophie added, they're my mom and dad. My mom is at her bakery right over there. She pointed toward town. We were picking buttercups for a recipe she is trying out. Suddenly, Sophie had a great idea. They could all go back to the bakery together to surprise Mrs. Mouse. Mrs. Snake loved the idea. Hattie Owen and Mrs. Snake helped Sophie pick fresh buttercups to replace the ones that had scattered when she fell. Then they walked together, the, walked together to the bakery. Sophie and Hattie walked in first. Mrs. Mouse was happy to see them because she was she had started to worry a little bit. Then Olivia and Owen came in and Mrs. Mouse nearly dropped her cookie sheet. Oh, I'd know that face anywhere. There they are. Hugging, do you see them right here? Oh, I'd know that face anywhere, Mrs. Mouse said. Olivia Snake! Lily Mouse, cried Olivia. Mrs. Mouse gave Mrs. Snake a big hug while Sophie jumped and clapped for joy. Happy surprises were the best. Well, this calls for a celebration, Mrs. Mouse declared. She fixed up a tray of pastries and made a pot of tea. Then the two old friends sat down at a cafe table to chat and catch up. Here they are chatting. Meanwhile, Sophie, Hattie, and Owen set up their own tea party behind the counter. They took turns sneaking pastries from the grown-up's tray. Here they are over here. After a few cookies, Sophie asked the question she'd been wondering all week. Owen, how come you never came back to school? Owen hesitated. Well, my mom used to be a school teacher, he said. She's teaching me at home, for now at least. Owen looked down. Anyway, I didn't think anyone liked me. Oh, no, Hattie burst out. That's not true. Not exactly. Sophie gulped, feeling embarrassed. I think it was just, well, we were all a little nervous. None of us had ever met a snake before. She took a deep breath. Oh, we're really sorry, Owen. Soon it was time for the snakes to leave. Sophie thanked Owen again for saving her. Will, you, will, will we see you at school on Monday, she asked. Owen moved slowly toward the door, then he looked back at Sophie. Maybe, he said with a smile. And that's the end of chapter nine. Okay, well, that was a great surprise, wasn't it? Okay, well, let's come back again and, and watch chap, uh, and you guys can watch me read chapter 10. Okay, I love you.